Ja, så börjar bara. Allow me to present to you the really intermittent motion sensing drill. Now, some of you may be asking, why on earth would you need a really intermittent motion sensing drill? Well, uh, this is actually for an art project. Uh, someone commissioned me to very cheaply uh, put together something that uh, can run like a mechanism in a scarecrow. And uh, they had sourced, let's turn this light thing off, uh, they'd actually sourced uh, some of these uh, 12 volt uh, passive infrared sensors, uh, which were quite good for the application, but uh, uh, this one they'd actually managed to explode by running way too much current through it. Uh, and uh, uh, they had the issue where they would run for way too long uh, and also explode in other ways. Uh, so, uh, I've solved all the issues with these. Uh, I have no idea what kind of a China import thing this is, but you can see some of my uh, modifications here. So, uh, this thing would run uh, at a minimum of uh, 12 seconds when it was uh, coming out of a box. Uh, and uh, it's an, a completely analog thing built around some uh, off-the-shelf China PAR sensor and an LM324 uh, and uh, it's just capacitor timing based so we have a timing cap uh, which was an electrolytic right there was 100 microfarads now it's uh, I believe a 2.2 mic uh, film cap and that's uh, just to cut the timer down from 12 seconds to basically infinity to uh, you know 1 second to 12 seconds or so uh, and uh, these uh, would probably fry if we didn't install this uh, big low ESI capacitor cross power input uh, since uh, we have a hugely noisy uh, brush DC motor with a China uh, driver going. Uh, I would actually see uh, this basically can't sink much current at all and when it's running uh, we, I think we can still see uh, Turn on Turn on Turn on and we still see. No, we can't see, but uh, let me shut up. Uh, the uh, voltage would actually spike up to 20 volts on the readout because it just couldn't sink all the noise coming out of the drill, turn into a great big boost converter, the entire thing, uh, which uh, wouldn't be particularly good uh, for this uh, poor guy with its rather basic filtering. But just having a huge low ESR cap in there uh, remedied that issue. And uh, now we have a very intermittent motion sensing drill, which is going to power a scarecrow. There you go. That's a thing as well.